tuned into me, 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 million dollars worth of game. I'm gonna tell you some real funny stuff, right? What? Listen, man, we got Harlem's finest up here, but first, mm-hmm. I gotta tell you some funny stuff, and I and I think I'm gonna laugh at Cam and Mace about this too. A week ago, I asked Gil. I said, "Cuz, did you really think like you was going to the NBA, or was you just balling?" He said, "Yeah, dead serious." That was the funniest shit I heard like in, in all my life. Cause I never thought I never thought that he would ever thought. I'm thinking like he just playing ball. I'm like, cuz is cuz is four nine and a, nine and a half. You know what I mean? With some yeah, with Tim's on. And, and so I said, I got I said, yo, did Cam and Mace think this shit too? Did they, talk, did they think they was going pro? Like I'm like, hold up, hold up, hold up. Cause I know dudes around the way just be rolling. I'm like, did these dudes really think? Cause I said, Gil said, yeah, I knew I was. I said, Gil, you, Gil, you played for like, you paid for like a D three college. That shit was like North Philly University of. You said he went to college in a strip mall. Yeah, that too. That's what I'm saying. It was like a little small joint that they back then they didn't have online, but that would have been an online college. <laughs> he told, listen, he will tell me. He tell me. I got. He, he would say, I got. I got offers from. He said, Notre Dame. I said, Bro, you went to a local college. You didn't get offers from. <laughs> Do you tell him the boards the SATs? Yeah, yeah, I say like, T was crazy though. Yeah, nah, it was what crazy. What did you score on it? It's like a six sixty. <laughs> we no, you know what's crazy? Nah, I'm glad you brought SATs up, bro. This is act like he, this act like you got a fifteen fifty on yeah, the SAT. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what that's what I say, yo. Well, why you go to college? Cut, cut it out, man. <laughs> why you ain't go to no school? Can't, like y'all was neighborhood basketball players. Mason it. tell you. He got left back to chill with me. Because <laughs> 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 I stayed actually. Because yeah. <laughs> that's, that's, that's how cool he was with me. But I say, T- Gil is not lying. Them SATs was no joke. So, what offers you got? What offers y'all got? I got offers Georgetown, Long Beach, uh, USC. The whole thing is, though, when we lost, like my senior, so my senior year, we went 23 and 0 and lost in the first round. I never went back to school. Like I was that depressed. I went to Albany and started selling weed because my my baby, I didn't have a baby, my girlfriend at the time, she's a year older than me and she was in Albany. So I just went up there after that and started selling weed and kind of never went to school again. But then I started thinking like, damn, I gotta get ready to go to school. But I was good enough for them to put me in a junior college because I didn't graduate. I didn't take the SATs. I just was like, they'll figure it out. Cause if, if you good, good, they'll figure it out. Yeah. Right? Oh, so y'all wasn't that good then. Yeah. 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 It wasn't that good. Yeah, yeah, you, 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 you're looking at it. Let me tell you something, Let me tell you something. I swear to God, I told Mace this. I said, I didn't really know basketball until I stopped playing basketball because I'm too emotionally yeah. invested in it. You so like when you when you sit there and watch other players, you'll sit there and be like, yo, this is want to fight. This is like dumb. Yo, this is carrying guns. But you may have done all that, but I don't know what the excuse is today, but in the 90s playing basketball, yeah. you have to know how to fight yeah. and play basketball. You know what I'm saying? Uh-huh. It's a different story because we watch an NBA fight and play basketball. Yeah. So when you stop playing ball, you can sit down and really and look at how basketball is supposed to be played. The real basketball been play, player most likely been playing since they was eight or nine years old. Uh-huh. So you're that emotionally invested. So... To Gil's point, yes, we all thought we was going to yeah, the NBA. Yes. 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 Did you think you was going to jail? <laughs> no, I didn't think that. <laughs> <laughs> but I didn't think that. But you did. I, I knew I was telling was going to happen, but I, right. I didn't think that. But, you know, at the, at the end of the day, I just thought that was the funniest shit I heard. Wow. He t- you 4'11". I'm a hood legend. Like, you 4'11". Like, what you tell on? Like, I respect your, your 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 neighborhood basketball game. You got neighbor. This is like this. You got neighborhood rappers and you got get the f- song oh, rappers. Dude's hot in the neighborhood. The song don't translate into the. To, it, it don't translate regional. You ain't no regional yeah, game. You a hater, man. It wasn't like dudes in Jersey, uh, Baltimore, bro, bro, DC on, knew about break, your break, game. Hold on, bro. We said we had Rashid Wallace on here. A that I played against in high school, with in high school, made every All Star team, played everywhere. What are you talking about? He said, "No, Gil was you that." You used to smoke Reggie together behind the house. <laughs> Nigga, that shit don't matter. It don't count. Y'all was smoking Reggie, drinking forties. Like, come on, man. Like, everybody, everybody we bump into, take Will Parks. He's a football player, His dad, bro. Who I played against in high school said, "No, Gil was that." Was starting a, at the legendary, starting yeah. at the legendary Benjamin his, his, Franklin his, High School, yeah. we sent everybody to the pros bro, first. Bro, bro. We did his that. Dad was yeah. a, I started at the legendary. Dad, shout out to legendary coach Kenny Hamilton, Hall of Fame. Right, I started. But listen, so listen, why nobody family. took that SAT for you? 
That's what I'm saying. He wasn't I good. Mean, back then, we wasn't, you know, we wasn't really up on that shit like that. We just knew <laughs> we had to take it all. Right, give me the test. How many years did you start? Three. Okay. So for, since a sophomore, you started. What are we talking about? Said three. No, I'm talking about three. three. I'm that nigga. What are we talking oh, no, about? No, no, Max. How many years you started? Four. Ooh. <laughs> well, I, well, I, I didn't go to Franklin and the friends of freshmen. I got kicked out of another school, yeah. and then I went to Franklin. Yeah, but I, I started all four years wow. since a freshman. Can you vouch for that, Mace? I only played with him three years, Paul. Oh. And you was older than him. You was 22 in high school. God bless <laughs> 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 who was Who was the raw, I'm talking about the, had the greatest game that never made it in Harlem? That was, di- oh. I'm talking about, was a monster, like, that could have went to the league. Allie Maul. Ali Mo, Ali Mo, a hundred percent. A little bit, Mason. Ali Mo, Ali Mo, a hundred percent. Ali Mo. Where he at? He, he passed died. away. Rest in peace. Yeah, nah. Yeah. You might know from the N one. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Don't yeah. do him no justice. Yeah. Six seven, six eight point guard, best man I've seen. Like probably from Harlem, I would say. Period. Mm-hmm. Pro or not pro. I'm saying anything because you know somebody asked me about you know sham sham guards. I he from yeah, my neighborhood. Yeah. So they asked us, like, who would you take, Sham or Ali Mo? And I was like, Sham was a monster too. But if yeah. you got a 6'9 point guard yeah. that does everything, I'm talking about a 2.0 Magic Johnson. Yeah. Like, I, I have to say Ali Mo. Mm. Did, did, you know, I'm one of them hip-hop. I want to say Sad Eye from yeah, Philly. Yeah, yeah, he was a beast. Well, before I messed my ACL up, they was, I was what in the, the ring. Out of here. I, seen, <laughs> I, I seen you on them crazy. Man, while I you seen it? No, I, 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 nasty. I, I seen Gil, I seen Gil carrying you in them two on two. He's like this. nasty. Yeah, I had a, I, like, I come in there and foul you, people. I'm saying you, you, you come in and foul. That's yeah. my, that's my you job. Play like Dennis Rodman and shit. That's, right, that's my you, game. You Greek freak brother. Yeah. 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 Oh, they, listen, I don't know yeah. nothing about this. I just, I just know that they're not that good. Yeah. They got a lot of effort. Yeah. They, they not that good. They got a lot of yeah. effort yeah. and energy. I heard about that. Yeah. Now, 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 why is it that? Why is it that? Listen. Y'all paying, y'all three, because y'all, y'all really like sports almanac dudes. Y'all paying, I'm talking about, whole, I'm talking about this powerful out here when it comes to these athletes. I'll be seeing all three of y'all. If any three, any one of y'all say something about an athlete, and y'all be y'all be right with what y'all saying, they get in their feelings. What's going on? Why y'all, y'all opinions are stronger than the, the sports network's opinions? What is that about? It's, it's because like when when they're saying it, it mess you up like corporately. But when we said it, it don't just hit corporate; it hit the hood as well. It hit okay. the streets as well. So it's one thing for somebody to say you're not good that you never got to see them. But when Gil said, I said, or Killer said, it's like these are the things that this is gonna matter when I go back to the block. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So it, it 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 knocks out that cool factor a little bit. And not only that, to add on to what Mace is saying, it's like, yo, fuck with us on the music coming up. Yeah. So they like, damn, yeah. damn, that, this is what I fuck with. And look, we got to deal with that as entertainers or rappers too, though. The yeah. album was whack. Yo, yeah. Cam, you ain't better than this, oh, yeah. or, or Cam, you ain't Hove, Gilly, you ain't Wayne. Yeah. This, the, you, we got to deal with that too, and we got to eat right. that. You boys. ain't Ricky Minaj. You yeah. Right. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Right. They told you that up the jail. Yeah, you right. would never be Kevin the Style, you know. Right. You right. So it hurts. Like I give you a great example. So one of these players, I can't remember who, said that they said, "Yo, I, I'm from the era where um, Paul George is the goat." Yeah. So I did an ep- we an episode. We like definitely Paul George is the goat, like of goats of all goats. I'm so upset. I said, "Shorty, you smoking? You I don't know what the f- you talk. I like Paul George, but yeah. is he the goat?" Nah, he not the GOAT. Make a long story short, a month later, fast forward, Macy, uh, Paul George in the casino out in, in Vegas out here. And he ran he down. He ran down. Why well, can't be the GOAT? Why well, can't be the GOAT? <laughs> what, what's up with that? I can't be the GOAT? <laughs> so, like oh, you said. Well, I don't know. Wait, but I, what, did, what did Macy say? Mason? I call Cam. You call me because <laughs> he's like, oh, he's killer. He call Cam. He's killer. He's killer. He's killer. George said, Cut. why he can't be the GOAT? He said, I got a question, killer. Um, Paul George said, <laughs> why he can't be the GOAT, killer? I told him, I said, you know what? I say, all right, you the GOAT, my Yeah. Then he did some dumb shit. Two weeks later, I said, I got to take it back. No, he said, he said, so why? How you going to take this GOAT shit? 
that. Because he said, he said something about Larry Bird pause. I said, I'm taking it away. <laughs> off, off the, what? The, yeah, I, I, it, wasn't ba- it wasn't even basketball related why I took his goat shit away. It was some yeah. wild shit he said. I said, just for that, I got to take you from not being the goat no more. I put you as the goat for two weeks. Now you're not the goat. But he had a podcast. It, it's funny, too. Shout out to Paul George. Yeah. Now, no, hold on. Fuck that. <laughs> you done asked our questions in a row. I got I to gotta put this out there because I've seen a little you know, interview, you know, pop up. Cam came across my page, you know, and I had, that was the moment I realized, like, damn, Cam and Wallow is similar. What you, what you talking about? <laughs> Cam know was it. talking about, you know, back when he was a youngin, some girl <laughs> swipe a tongue across his ass whoa, like a Visa whoa, MasterCard. Whoa, <laughs> whoa, whoa. Yeah, I mean, whoa. You know, he said, he said, you know, he was, he said he was the episode he was talking about, you know, you know, I didn't know Cam was Rim Brown. You know what I'm <laughs> I didn't know he was Rim Brown. Rim, Remington Steel. Yeah, this is motherfucking. Yeah. Uh, we got Rim Brown, Rim Brown, and Remy Butler over here. Yeah. <laughs> you hear me? No, no. A, dry, a drive-by don't count. No, no. Yeah. it was a drive-by. No, yeah. Yeah. So she did a drive-by on Cam? I don't know, Yo, man. listen, man. While Cam I see you calling the dick doctor the other day, we'll talk about that in a minute. I don't know no, what that no, was. No, no, no. no, 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 no. No, no, I don't know what happened. No, I'm, I'm gonna cool. tell you what happened. Yeah, 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 cool. I, I did 7,300 days in jail. And yeah. I said, because I squeezed one out of no, his ass. No, what happened was. You broke your. No, what happened was. Wait, 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 wait. When that one yeah. start off, what happened was, it's crazy. Yeah. Yeah. No, 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 so, no, so what listen, happened yeah. was, what guy? Yeah. No, and then he no, told it. He told it. He said, so you can put three inches on? No, I seen no, it. Yeah, no, he no, said, no, I'll really be in the game. I seen it. That's exactly what he said. What happened is, you know, everybody was into it. You know what I mean? I can't even say that, man. No, what happened now, I'm going to go what happened was. So the other day, and I'm glad you asked me this. So, uh, you know, our moderator stat, we gave an opportunity to give our, get our own show. Yeah. She wanted to interview Joe Smith's wife. Oh, yeah. And um, so we was like, God, like me and Mace don't work on that day. But she was saying that she wouldn't do the interview unless me and Mace was there. And Mace had obligations. And it was a hot topic that week. So I said, fuck it, I'll go in. And when we got there, she was oiled up, cleavage out. <laughs> um, very seductive, and uh, you bit. I, I, you made me work on my off day. I'm going. I'm coming to work, <laughs> so I, I I commented on what I seen because you know what girls like to do. They like to uh, Daisy Dukes oil yeah. up to the thighs, mm-hmm. fat ass. But you're not allowed to comment on it. I'm commenting on any part of skin I see. If you got a nice shoulder, I like your shoulder. Damn, so you got a nice you get a bit. Yeah, if you got, <laughs> yeah, if, you got yeah, if you got a nice thigh, I like your thigh. If I see your cleavage, I'm gonna tell you I, I like your cleavage now. If you tell me I'm I'm being inappropriate, I'm sorry. But yeah. if you tell me, oh thank you, now we're gonna go further and see how far we can get. That's mm. what led to the whole shit to what we was talking about. Eating ass. I don't get my ass eaten. But you have. I'm just I, saying. I have. I have. I'm talking about why. I walk past, oh, oh, past Los with I walk past Low Hotel room out here. Get everything. Leave me out. He like it. 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 Yeah, I'm, like, yeah, I'm, like, yeah, I'm like, that low in it? Yeah. I ain't you know what? That wasn't easy. You my girlfriend now. Yeah. I'm like, wait, no, what? So, this when I was 15. I didn't know no yeah, better. She took advantage and, of and it. Was, yeah. Yeah. That it happened to me when I was young, but it was it was. Now, don't go young because I said young. Now, yeah, 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 if you was in the hotel room, this was recent. Yes, it was. Look at everything. Clean me out. Clean me out. Yeah, <laughs> you my girlfriend now. I'm gonna keep it all the way real. Well, we came in and I mentioned it to Cam, and I said, "Uh, damn, dog, I ain't know you. You know you, you like rimmers, you know." I said, "Wallo, well, love them rimmers." Mace turned around fast, and like. Wallow down with the rimmers too. <laughs> oh, so I know Mason. Mason was back in the day. He had three of them in the attack. <laughs> Let me get some. <laughs> Let's be clear before we put this out there. No, Mason was the first. My ass no. <laughs> no. I was not I never, no regular thing, nigga. I was 15. We, uh, right. But I'm sitting there telling you. 
A bitch will offer you. Cakes ain't on no, the weekends, no, no, bro. listen. Some bitches will tell you that's what get them off. I tell them get under the balls <laughs> and don't go lower. Oh, so y'all Gucci boys. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Gucci yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Y'all I Gucci. definitely go Gucci. I'm Gucci man. Man. I'm definitely <laughs> Gucci. Definitely. But you can't swipe me. <laughs> yeah. Hit you with a body shot. What you doing? <laughs> <laughs> Too fucking doing. What <laughs> fuck you doing out there, too? That's crazy. Hey, did you just... Did you no just well. sexually you, assault me? That, that's a fact. And they'll bring it back up on you later yeah. in the, in the, when it's time in the argument. See, see, go to his Gucci, be like, lower. Lower. Why you think you laughed like that? Or like, <laughs> now, now, now. Out the whole time. Uh, oh. you like, stop lying All right, go ahead, man. Now. I'm going to let you live. What's it, what, what? Mace, did, you know, you come yeah. out when you sold all the records. Did you think, did you feel as though you was the king of New York ever? That's a good question. I'm, you know, I need, because nobody talk about that. Like, you know what I mean? Was you, did you, you just came out, did numbers. Did you feel as though you was the king of New York? I think, I think there was a summer I felt like that. There was a summer I felt like that. Cole came right in, Rolex diamond. Mm -hmm. Fuck you, you done it that. I was gonna bring that Roly here today. Yes. I see the award today. Bro, so you know what I mean? Damn, Hov peeped it though, Hov. Yeah. Did that mess you up though when Hov and Hov came at you like that? I mean, it it probably that was the first time I experienced what we talking about rappers, um, athletes deal with now when when you diss by somebody you thought was cool, and you're mm. like, why is this old hating on me? You know what I'm saying? Mm. That's all I really thought about it. All right now, now this the whole thing. We, we, in New York, who was like the first dudes to really put the fly nigga rap down? That fly nigga rap. You know what I mean? That talking about the clothes. And if he wasn't the, from Harlem, get, give it up to him. Because I know y'all skip right over a nigga to go to Harlem. Nah, <laughs> I, I, we keep it real. Like, even when you was talking about the point guards, um, now God, just best basketball players, I was thinking, I was throwing through it last night. I was like, Queens might got the best point guards in New York yeah. City when I was thinking about it. We seen Kenny Smith last night and shit. He's like, damn, Queens, yeah, Queens might have yep, the best. Mark Jackson, Kenny skip Anderson. The, yeah, skip the Malou. Them the, yeah, them awesome. might have the best point guards in New York City. So we ain't, I ain't on that type of time. But for me, if I can remember off the top, there's a lot of this. Because once you started getting them big ass rope chains and everything else, if I had to say fresh, I'm going to go probably Dougie Fresh. No, I'm, talking, I'm talking about rapping. Oh, rap. Fly, the rap. The rap when you're talking Talk about it. Talking that, you know, that putting the shit on, talking. You got to you know realize, I mean? like, yo, we we like around the same age. Bro, I know you probably the youngest, so yeah. we've been looking. Yeah, all y'all like 51, right? Nah, my oh, f Okay, my f <laughs> you, We all in our 40s. Right. In our 40s. So, including you, Wallow. So, yeah. Damn, I'm 40. So, so the whole thing is like, if you've been listening to rap since you six or seven, it's hard to say who because, you know, um, I'm, I'm, I'm sitting here trying to answer your question because I'm thinking of, Clothes and jewelry and was everything else. Was it Big else. Daddy Kane? Big Daddy Kane was talking. Sh no, but I'm talking about bringing it up. I ain't talking about that far back, you know. Because if you gotta do that, you talking about G rap. You talking about all, you know what I mean? Yeah, but Big Daddy Kane Ice. used to talk. Sh yeah, he used to talk. He used to talk. So he was the first. Yeah, that's when you actually yeah, like you can see that. Talk. Yeah. I, yeah. that. That's a great answer. Talk but I'm talking about y'all generation. Talking. Everybody's talking. Shit when we start talking. See, it's different talk. Big Biggie, Biggie, mm. Biggie, Biggie yeah. was the nigga that made fly the rap, but black and ugly as ever. However, yeah, I stay that. G down to the yeah. socks, rings and watch filled with rocks. Hit my jam knocks and you miss your beat. Man, it was like you wanted to go get <laughs> yeah. a fucking Gucci sweater. I, I did, I did yeah. too. Yeah. I'm just saying, a lot but, of but, 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 but it seemed like it seemed like it went to another level. When the, when it sounds like you got somebody in mind, Wallo. Yeah. It sounds like you no, got, no, no, you no, got no, somebody in mind. No, no, no. I'm African being bottled. No. Oh, uh, <laughs> see, you trying to play. No, <laughs> no, no. You know what? You know what? I'm going to say this. I'm going to say this about Mace, right? Mace was talking that shit on a whole different level. Like, when it, you know, when Get That Money Right came out, them Desert Storm mixtapes, it was a different, it was a different lyrical shit going on. You know, Biggie, Biggie was always that. We got it. Can't take him from Biggie. But... When, when you, when you talking, no, no, no. When you talking that <laughs> shit, it was certain shit that you can't talk about because you can't fit and you can wear it. Mm -hmm. Biggie is that dude, mm -hmm. but he couldn't talk. Like Mace was talking that. Shit, like he was when, talking. Like when get that money right, he was talking. What did he say? He said, "When you a good fella, you get cheddar for your work 
Rock Versace leather shirts. When you fuck a girl, it hurt. I'ma cruise around the world with a mean golden girl. <laughs> Dough full of pearls, drinking mo till she earl. Mm -hmm. I need a hundred hoes, cause I got a ton of those that live up on bungalows with sexy underclothes. <laughs> Lil' Mace, look at Lil' Mace. <laughs> 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 But hold up, hold up, cuz. Yeah. Hold up, cuz. It was a lyrical execution of that shit. You know what I mean? Um, and it was like the beats and all that. It was a different level of fly to talk. Mm -hmm. And that's what I'm saying. Like, even, even like when you look at it now, you don't see it too much. You might hear it throw a little gear in there. But I'm talking about that fly talk where it's like, I'm get, it was like this. I'm getting money. Man. I put that shit on. I fuck your bitch. And if we go through a problem about something, I'm going to get my worker to shoot you. I ain't going to shoot you because I get money. I'm not no shoot. I'm a money getter. Mm -hmm. That was the rap lingo. And the structure of it is that the shoot is the worker. Mm -hmm. you, you know, so it was just like this whole live boss rap shit. And it was like the cadence of it. It was crazy. And it was like, it was just a different yeah. time, man. And it was like, the mixtapes. Man, feel some way of way about you, No, no, Mace was that dude. Make, listen, listen, my, listen. Oh, <laughs> shut up. <laughs> I want your rap. I put you in a rap game. Keep it real. I took you to the studio. <laughs> I was your first manager. <laughs> listen, I still got your contract. Why don't you tell us why you really remember that shit? No, no. It, it won three prison talent shows for you. Fuck what you talking about. That's line. But what I'm saying is, what I'm saying is, yeah. Mace didn't even remember that. No, no, no. He's like, damn, this is good. I, I, I'm keeping on there. When you spit, I was like, yeah, that was that. Shit. Was that? Yeah. Shit. Yeah. Now, I like, told you when we done mixtapes, the mixtapes was all that. Mace would used to, we used to rhyme hard, but then when the deal came in and the money came in, <laughs> he switched it up. Got, nah, it's still murder too, but that, <laughs> he switched that, it that, up. That, that, my favorite. I still use one of Mace lines from the mixtapes with certain. When I move, when I say move, let's go or get left, yo. Yeah, like it was them. Yeah, type that was of that was the lyrics yeah, exactly. And, and it was the production and you know, uh, kissing all them. All of them was on there, just destroyed, just body in it. And it was this, this New York sound that was coming out that was different, and it was an excitement tour because everybody was on the mixtape. Yo, you get the mixtape, you get that Desert Storm, the, the DJs, and it was like, damn. They was just, X was on shit. DMX, rest in peace to him. Oh yeah, I asked him a question too. Who was better, DMX or Tupac? Mm. I ain't got time for that shit, man. No. Y'all make y'all about the internet going crazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, say what you want to say. Crazy. I, me personally, I seen DMX. I didn't really get to see. I'm talking about on tour with DMX. I'm in yeah. the studio with DMX. See, I actually got to see go lose their mind about yeah. DMX. I know love Tupac, but I didn't get to see him on tour and do anything else. Yeah. So for me, it's gonna be. DMX because I actually got to be a part of or see from when he was just in the tenement rapping to selling 10, 20, however many millions of records he sold. I seen the whole process. What about you, Mace? Oh, man. That, to me, I would I would definitely have to say DMX because, and not just East, West, like when you saw the energy pause that this the DMX gave, it's like just... You could just stop one lyric that he would be saying in a whole concert and the whole arena would say it. Like, I think a lot of times because you learn the flaws of this, you forget how great this really were. Like, DMX was one of those, like, special, special talents. Yes, and, he was. And when I, when I first heard DMX in the studio, I was just like, yo, this is... It's just different. Like, we was in the studio. That's how he ended up on my album on, like, two records. And then from there, he went and did his deal and all of that stuff. But I was like, yo, this is crazy. Now, what about Pac you? Was, Pac was phenomenal, too. I can't take nothing away from yeah. Pac. But DMX, I think DMX had more than <coughs> Pac. I'm going to go on the record and say that. He had more than Pac because DMX was able to give you um just, just a different, he just touched pause in a different way than Pac did. You know, I was more of a Tupac dude. You I knew you was going to say But you said DMX was the best performer you ever seen ever in seen life. in my life. Yeah. DMX, That's what I mean. DMX was the best performer I ever seen in my f***ing life. When that nigga came out at that f***ing spectrum and he walked on that f***ing stage, that shit, I'm talking about that shit, damn near it was, it was about to fall from the Raptors in that 
motherfucking man. That was his, one of the greatest performances I've yeah, ever seen in my life. Before DMX come on the stage, he be backstage growling on the mic and the crowd going crazy. You just hear the nigga growling. That's 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 you hear all that shit? You like Jake, the whole crowd before he walk out yeah. is losing their mind just off so that One, two, one, two. Oh, yeah. What the yeah. 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 That shit was so X ridiculous. So X was definitely the better rapper, and Pac was probably the better artist. Just I don't, to get I don't know Pac. because I don't know who was the better rapper. I know they both had great songs. I know they both was a way above average rappers. They was mm -hmm. they was top tier. You know what I mean. Pac gave you a certain type of feeling in one way, and DMX gave you a certain type of feeling in another way. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. But um, that's a great debate, though. Mm -hmm. I love both of them. Rest in peace to both of them. They were both truly great artists. Now, all of y'all put projects out, right? The fuck out of here. We ain't going up with this. No, no, I ain't trying. I ain't mean to say Gil. Gil was a white bum ass rapper. He was a fell rapper. <laughs> Cash money reject. That's a different story. Um, That's cool. Go ahead and take your shots, baby. No, but it's like I got you, you. When you think about Harlem in New York, it was like man, it was just it was just this sound, man. Children of the Corn. Y'all had all these movements. McGruff from Harlem, ain't he? Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. McGruff. Who was the greatest Harlem rapper of all time? Mm. Don't do that to them. I like got that. to. Don't do that to them like that. Change the question up. No, man, man stop being Don't do that to them niggas serious. like that. <laughs> Don't do that to them like that. Who was the greatest Harlem rapper of all time? Yeah. Mm. <laughs> wow. That was a good question. You talking about everybody in their prime? We talking everybody. Everybody you, in their prime. Yeah. All right. This is... um. Don't be humble. They definitely wouldn't like my list. Say it. Who you, who you think, Killer? Who are you? Just give me your top five. Who's number? But I need the top five to be one, two, three. Yeah, then three, we can get to that. Four, but first, we got to agree on the Not five. No, we just name it. I'm going to be honest with you. It's just about who you like. If you're actually my favorite rapper from Harlem, I'm going to say Mace. I'm just being stripping down. You got to listen. You got Kumo D. You got Rob Bass. You got Dougie Fresh, you got the ASAP News, you got Dipset. Who else are you gonna name from Harlem? I'm just saying, it isn't like Brooklyn or Queens where you're gonna name 75 rappers. It's probably 12 of us, if I'm not if I'm not mistaken. Loon too, you got Loon. ASAP. I just, yeah. I said the ASAP. Big dude. L. Big L, of course, Big, Big L, L was definitely, a good absolutely. But see, it's like Big L, and that's my man, we from the same block, that's my dude. He only got to do like, a, it was, he didn't have a long time to do what he right. could really potentially do. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? He only had one album. Right. So when I'm thinking about the list, it may be 10 to 12 people. I think Big L was better than anybody in Harlem. That's a great no, point. No, no, no. The reason I'm going to say that is because he was so advanced when he died. If he he get a deal, he was, I'm talking about a real joint, he was out of there. Yeah. Like, think about it. Think about the advancement of the way he was breaking that shit down, his wordplay. You know See, what I mean? The thing about His Big, attitude. The thing about Big L is yeah, that, that I, I feel like, like, yeah, he had me. No, I'm just saying. No, no, no he, he did. He, that, <laughs> I'm not going to say that. I know he's <laughs> not going to say that. <laughs> I'm not going to say that. I'm not the one. He's like, like, I'm uh, not the one. He's like, he look, he like, he's 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 like, be like, oh, the camp trying. So that's my. Just like for me, it's like it's like Big L better after he died. <laughs> my opinion, yeah. they start. Oh, he's a legend. This that third. And he was nice before he died. You gotta realize him and Nas is on the same label at the same time. Mm -hmm. Columbia Records. So you got Nas and Big L coming out at the same time, and you kind of seeing who elevated more. So mm -hmm. it wasn't like he wasn't on a major record label or he didn't have an opportunity. It was kind of, you was wasn't he, boy, was wasn't he ready to give a Rockefeller? Something yeah. like that. That's, yeah. that's what I'm saying. Like mm -hmm. get that extra push. That's yeah. all. And listen, I'm not, I'm not dissing out because that's my boy, very lyrically talented. Mm -hmm. I just don't think he had enough time. But I let me say who he's going to say. Yeah, yeah, man. No, it's, it's I'll tell you, man, Big L ain't their favorite rapper because it sounds good to say if it you from sounds, You know, like yeah. a lot of times Die and you just you put twenty on pump ten. You know what I'm saying? Okay, <laughs> 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 
Come on, like <laughs> no, because this is what I try to explain to people, and I'm glad Killer said it because it's like L was alive when I was there, so yeah. he got to see me. He, I mean, he put he put he he did his whole album. He put everybody on that he put on. I was like the person that he put on the record, so I always had that chip on my shoulder, uh-huh. like all oh, these left me off the record, uh-huh. you know what I'm saying? Yeah. But I was happy because Killer went crazy and- You did American Dream. Yeah, he did. But when he did Eight is Enough, I said, yo, you pick Eight is Enough? You know how I think, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm definitely like, feeling away. I'm yeah, like, that's what's oh, this shit put all these <laughs> on here and he ain't put me on there. Yeah. So I, I really, I held that forever. Yeah. So I, when I got my shot, I was just like, yeah, I gotta, I gotta be better than these. Huh. You know who I want to give a shout out to? Who? I want to give a shout out to me, sister, baby Stace. And I'm hold on, tell hold you on. Why. Before Wait, we get to let's that, get that list. I was just about to say yeah, what you were going to get. I was just let's about to say what you were going to say. Let's get to that list. I want to know who the fucking top rapper in the all is. Who's number one? The top the top rappers, I definitely. No, the top rapper. Let's go start with number one. Do we want to go to number two? I would go with me. I would go with me. Man. I agree with Cam. You know what I'm saying? That's my I would agree with that. I'm going to get my Nah, I ain't going to go against these. Who two? Um, I would go Killer in second. Who three? Um, this is this is Don't interesting. Don't you dare drop that nigga ASAP Rocky. No, 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 no. goddamn no. three. I think it's, it's that the city never got to hear no, but ASAP took it to the world. No, I, it's other n- it's like it's other. N- it's, now, would you say, say the n- names? You would you write. say um? Would you say Trooper J was better than L? If he would have got his shot, it's so it's, it's, it's n- that was hold crazy. On, hold 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 on, time out. You just going? ASAP took it to the world. Nah, we took it from we home gonna, to the We're gonna get to that. We're gonna get to that. All right, go ahead. You talking about that? What, now, what record ASAP ain't put you on? <laughs> oh. You know, he's saying that's why you mad at ASAP because he ain't put you <laughs> on the record. ASAP, right? You, you, you know, basically, you know, because oh, no, you said rappers. You said rappers. You, rappers. Said, you look, didn't say like fashion. Yeah, I'm just about to you say. Rappers, and I'm right? about to say, do you know the ASAP? What's the ASAP lyric? I'm not saying you don't know. I'm asking you to sing it. Just like you sung May shit. You know? There's a, a lot of ASAP. I got ASAP on my on my playlist. I just asked you to do something. Look, that's it. <laughs> shout mean, out to ASAP. That's what I'm trying Rocky. to explain to you. Like he's you good say at, you can't live forever. I, I, I ain't got to keep going. Wait, I, but I'm just saying, like, oh, that's shut right, up, man. That's shut up, man. He was talking to you. He wasn't talking to me. Yeah, I would put. I would put ASAP. And I'm not saying I'm not saying that he ain't good. I'm just saying I would like to join. Yeah. Okay, but go ahead. We said so you go to the bands. Mm-hmm. Call us double That's new. You posed to know that. Don't know that government name. Mm-hmm. Just know this the name we share. Don't do That's no hoes, no stand. Don't do no pics, no share. And I so bright like can. <laughs> and I shine so bright like can. <laughs> Come on, I know it's what we know it's that. Yeah, so as it, I would go me, Killer. ASAP. Oh no, Trooper J. Hold on, man. Who know Trooper J? Shout out to I'm Trooper just, J. I'm just with Trooper you, J. You asked us because right, you no, wanted Harlem no, 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 no. Intel, okay, that's right? Harlem Intel. You right, want right. Harlem Intel, all right. right? Do we not talking about is like is that had a cool verse? We talking about who is lyrically gifted? Okay, so it's so Mace it's, Killer yeah, Trooper J. J. Trooper J. Um, Big I would L. have to go Big L, and then um, Mike Buggy. Damn, just left Jules Santana off there. All right, yeah, that f- no, that I don't forgot. Jules was being that Jules, list. Yeah. Yeah. Don't don't right Mace. Mace. Huh? No, I'm telling him off from Mace because he went trooping. The reason I said this, this is not my list. This is his list. Yeah. What's the name? What I'm saying is that when he brought up Trooper J, I'm thinking that who's in that era who didn't get a chance. It's dumb, yeah. nice. Isn't that who didn't was get a chance. Right. Like, like, you hear this and you like, this is, they ain't get on. You like, right. damn. He ain't never get a shot. Right. I don't know where he's at, but he right. was like, he was. And who's your different. list? 
I'm number one. I just said uh, Mace's my favorite rapper. Oh, I didn't say he's the best rapper. Uh, oh, I like that. I like that. Okay. Yeah. So your list is killer. Yeah. He's second. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I love that. Yeah. I knew he was gonna say that. That's why. That's why I kept myself first. I knew he was gonna say that. You know what I mean? Because that's what I say. If I do a Philly yeah. list, I'm saying me then first. I would, I would put Joel's third. And then I I put Big L fourth. It's like, like you like it's just that Big L didn't get enough time, man. Like you know, I think he a lot of the, he like he went back to you back. You put Jew before Big L. So he had more time. Jew like Jew yeah. is on two hundred mixtapes. He got yeah. bangers. Like like no, not, I'm not gonna like, lie. When I first heard Jewel's rap, I was like, yo, because at that time I wasn't speaking to Killer, so I was like, yo. <laughs> It's it got one. Yeah, like that. Nigga. I, like Jewels could have really been like he could have been on he could have been Hope level. Mm. Real, now, real talk, he had it, and he yeah. had it at a young age. He like he could have been the leader. Of everything that's going on yeah. outside right now, he could have been all these young father, uncle, whatever you want to call it. Like that's how much because the the chicks liked him. He yeah. could rap. He was fly. He had every element that you yeah. needed to be that. Yeah, he had the real wittiness to be yeah. like one of those special rappers. Right, exactly. What stopped him? You was there, I wasn't. Well, to be, and I'm going to be totally honest with you, to me, Jewel's, I wouldn't say poor work ethic, but I'm just not sure why. Jewel's will sit there with 300 songs on his hard drive and won't put it out. If you follow Jewel's now on his Instagram, I haven't spoken to Jewel's in a while, but he'll tell you next month, so and so is coming out next month. So and so is coming out so next month. So and so it doesn't come out. If you think about it, he wanted to get out his deal with me. Uh, I, he's like, I'm not putting out no music till I get out the deal with Cam, and then I'll put my album out. And he bought the deal since 2008. So I know he put little mixtapes out here and there, but he hasn't put out like a real project. So I'm not going to say he doesn't have great work ethic. I don't know what it is. Once he got the songs done, why they don't come out? I speak to his brother all the time. Most and, artists do that. And they and he's sitting there with 800 songs in the hard drive. So I have no idea. But once he wanted to get out his deal with me, I made it happen. And I just decided that we still brothers and still cool. But I have nothing to do with as far as your music career. That's since 2008. Everything but him. When it, when it, when we was working, look, we used to have to lock Jewels in the house, straight up and down. When when he's 15, 16, you don't want to go to school. You ain't going outside. You come with us to the club. Yo, you did them song. All them songs that you hear. The bangers was forced. Yo, write the song, my nigga. Write the song. But it got to a point where I can't treat you like you're, you're a grown man now. I can't yell at yeah. you. I can't scream at you. All them hits, uh, Gangsta Music, Santana's Town, mm -hmm. all the hot sh Hey Ma was when we about to walk out to the club. We had a crib in Chicago. And he'd be like, come on. I'd be like, did the 16? He'd be like, uh, da, da, da. I said, we'll bring your bitch back. You're not coming out until you finish the <laughs> song. You're not going. Straight like that, he'll tell you. And, then, and you're not coming out. We'll bring your hoe back. And if you, you finish the 16, we'll let you have her. Yeah, Jewel's was definitely and, top and, five. And that's how the songs came about. So when we start working together, I'm not saying the work I think I put, but for some reason, it's not translating into the public hearing it. Like I said, you go to this page now, every month he's saying, Something's coming out, something's coming out. And the reason I know this because I'm waiting. I'm a fan. Uh, uh, I'm mm. sitting there saying, when is, well, when's the shit coming out? Because I would like to hear it. Yeah. But it just doesn't come out for us. So I would put him a, a had a big L, definitely. And then who's five? I'm going to go I'll, Trooper J. I'm going to go Trooper yeah, J. Trooper like J. Oh, Trooper yeah, J. Trooper J. Oh, Trooper J. Oh, Trooper J. Trooper J. Y'all ain't got an old Trooper J tape or nothing. <laughs> I need to hear this. <laughs> Man. Trooper J was nasty, man. Trooper J was the he. Trooper J he was, was the one. See, was, that's what they don't want to tell us. Trooper J was the, he used the barbecue baked yes. ass. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, 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 he, was, yeah. he was the one that made us get my shit out of us. I'm gonna keep it on honey. Together. I wasn't better than Trooper J. Matter of fact, I'm gonna take Trooper J off that list, honestly. And he's number six for me. I'm gonna Mike put, Boogie. No, I'm gonna put Gruff at five. Yeah, but Gruff. Gruff, Gruff but he, so if Trooper J was the one barbecue baking y'all. Still why mad. They still mad. That's why he's pushing Trooper back. Trooper J, Eddie. They went really back in the day. I really couldn't Cam find nice. him. Killer Nice. What you mean you couldn't find him? They bring him Killer to Trooper J. Oh. Trooper J killed Killer out there. Nah, no, but Mace said he couldn't find him. You hear this? Mace was running from Trooper J like a mother.
Def- no, he was definitely like when I got my shot, he was definitely somebody I would have wanted to bring to the table. I couldn't find him. Trooper in the, J he was had in the DMX street. vibes, but more lyrical. Yeah. But that type of energy. Yeah. energy. He was DMX vibe with, with our kind of rap. Right. Mm. And, I, and the reason I, I, I put him six after Gruff is because I rap with Gruff every day. Gruff from my block. Yeah. Me, Gruff, and Big Gruff. Al from the same block. But Trooper J is a you see twice a year when you see him like, yeah, let's spit something. And you're like, oh, you still got Thousand that shit. Yeah, like, damn, you still got that shit. But we got our opportunity first. So Mace, like he said, he probably was. We was looking for niggas like yeah. that to go. You know, we got the chance. Let's bring these niggas in. But we, they wasn't you know, from my hood. Some was locked up. Some was on a run. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. But it was nice. Yeah, but I, I would have to put... Trooper J behind Gruff just because I used to just spar freestyle wise with yeah, Gruff, so Gruff two three times a week. Jewels, um, L, Killer, me. It is what it is. Now taking a <laughs> off. Now, now I got to give a shout out to Baby Stace because Baby Stace is the one that called that called Mason and said, "Man, what? Wallowing them, man? What happened, man? They got." They got five year old on there. Go, man, Wallow, that's that was my like, man, we I thought they fuck with you, man. And then May said, yo, man, I ain't getting nobody five thousand dollars. I gotta I gotta come up there. Yeah. And all this come out of that. Yeah. All because baby states wanted to put a check in or haul them checking on on me. She put a check in on you, you was bitching yeah, too. I mean yeah. bitching she like a and then, and then and then you know what's crazy though? When I see y'all, what I, what was so good about it is that a conversation changed everything. One conversation, bro. Like, y'all real live brothers, man. When Mace got up there and said, man, I used to wear camp clothes. That was my, that was like the, it, it showed, it showed a brother missing a brother and a brother just being real when nobody is in between. Sometimes people come between stuff yeah. and it'd be conversations because, because it'd be remixes. You know, I tell Gil something about Cam. Gil to put his own, not saying him particularly, people put their own Swiss twist on stuff based off of how they hate and how they want to, yeah, because what's the name? Oh, man, I ain't even going to tell you. Yeah. They be remixing, so y'all getting all these different stories, and it's once the conversation had, y'all jump in, and now look at y'all. Y'all y'all turning the game up. You see what I'm saying? But, but we never get a chance to have this in the hood. Luckily, y'all ain't go to the beef where it got real crazy, and the pistols got, you know what I mean? But now look at y'all. Y'all back on some brotherhood shit. Y'all winning. Y'all raking in the dough. You know, first of all, we want to say, I want to say thank you guys for yeah. even, because to be honest, without you guys' platform, we may not even still, maybe not even speaking. Yeah. So first of all, I want to just thank you guys, because be honest with you, we don't even, I don't do interviews. I told you, I, I do, mm-hmm. I do a million dollar worth of game and I do drink champs. I don't do any other interviews unless you pay me. Mm-hmm. Kind of like, because how many times you're going to say the same story? You know yeah. what I'm saying? That's just the way I think. But Thank you guys for even, you know, I, can, I didn't know it left from Stace, but you yeah. know, after hearing Mace talk, I'm like, damn, this my nigga be. So I got to go on. I was supposed to come on your show anyway. Yeah. Do you yeah. know what I'm saying? So I'm like, this is a perfect. It worked out. The timing was great. So, mm-hmm. but thank you guys for even giving us the opportunity because we got somebody in common. Um, Chanel, one, she's one of my publicists. Yeah. Yeah. And she, and she, my people. Yeah. So Chanel, she, we, and, you know, we, that's who we was in a meeting with before we had um, came back in here. And she's like, yo, you know, I work with Gilly all the time. Is it true? And I'm like, what, what, are, you, what are you talking about? She's like, Gilly always talking about, none of that shit would be going on if it wasn't for, for, for our platform. <laughs> Them motherfuckers wouldn't be getting this money and be speaking and nothing if it wasn't for us. We the ones who got the motherfuckers back together. I was like, yeah, he's right. Yeah, he's right. Yeah, <laughs> I said, yeah, yeah he's right. <laughs> she you know, definitely told me I that. I told her that LaFont said, no, that's how they got back together. Like, no, yeah. they ain't. Yeah, that's because, a fact. But look, the, the beauty in it is that we could show the young that a lot of times don't be that deep, man. Nope. Yeah. And right. we stronger together. Right. Yeah. You feel what I'm saying? That be the, that's the beauty in it, showing motherfuckers know we stronger together. Like, you got to understand, Cam was just doing what he was doing to get money. Mace was just doing what he was doing to get money. Just had a conversation, and then next to you, you know, millions of dollars come out of that. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And, and y'all brought, think and, about that. That was a beautiful day for millions all. Millions of dollars come out of that. Mm-hmm. Now these niggas is my and Brian Gumble and my and it's like and it's like just just understanding like 
it don't cause nothing to help to bring people together or give them information. Mm-hmm. You know, Cam called, Mace called, I said, get, put, get on the phone. This is how you do this shit. Mm-hmm. This the money. This is how we get. And they went and got the bag. You they know? went and got the bag. Yes, one, they did. One thing yeah. about it as well is like, because I always got offers, and nothing, to, of course, to do with Mace, but I'm just saying, I always got offers to do podcasts and be a part of kind. And I'm like, I don't really know about that shit. Like, I, I, I'm, I'm not sure if I want to do that. But I did know I like sports. But watching you two, um, do what you guys did. I don't. I don't really. Like, I, don't, I won't name names, but I don't really fuck with niggas like that. Mm-hmm. And, you know what I'm saying? I, I, don't, yeah. I don't like it. the niggas who supposed to be. I don't fuck with. Niggas. So when I seen y'all podcast, I'm like, yo, I, I fuck with uh, million dollars yeah. worth yeah. of game and Gillian Wild. I'm just, I could sit there and watch the niggas or listen to niggas in the car because you're on the same type of time I'm on. Right. Yeah. So I was like, that's dope. But then I said, yo, how's they doing? So let me eating. I was like, oh, they, it's money like that? <laughs> I said, you really to get money like that? I was like, yeah. Because y'all just don't really, if you, if you, especially if they don't follow you guys on Instagram, you guys don't wear a bunch of jewelry. Y'all not a bunch of flashy. Nah. Y'all buy them cars. So, you know what I'm saying? Y'all definitely get them cars. I'm like, um, let me make a couple phone calls, see the f- going on in this space. So you called me and I said, listen. Yeah, absolutely. I, I started definitely you guys first and then I called a few. But yeah. more of the story is just saying thank you for being the niggas that you are and making a nigga like me realize like, yo, they f- with some real niggas still right now. So right. that's what's up. Yeah, it's a, that's it's what's a, up. And a, I, I, listen, man, and the realness in this shit is that I re- we really look at niggas like brothers. So mm-hmm. anytime you need us for any information, anything, it's our duty to be like, oh, no, no, do this. Mm-hmm. No, do that. No, no, you want to do this so that this can happen. If we don't do that, we really some nut ass yeah. 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 That's just yeah. the reality of it. We don't never block nobody, anybody that we can help in this space because it's like, bro, it's enough money out here for everybody. Right. What the fuck is we talking about? I'm not in competition with because my check is already signed. That's guaranteed money. That's going to the bank. Mm-hmm. So, why y'all can't get some money? Right. The why they money. can't get some money? Why they can't? If you got a hot product that people like, what's the issue? Right. The, the Jews don't do that. Yeah. Right. The Arabs don't do that. Yeah, they put them out there. They like, no, you need a connect? Hold on. Let me make a phone call for you. Mm-hmm. So, it's time for us to be like that. Mm-hmm. That's right. Yeah. You know what I mean? By the way, man, make sure y'all get deals. No, 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 no. I was going to do my own commercial. One of our homies. I'm not going to put nobody out there. I'm not going to put nobody out there. One of our homies came in the refrigerator in the studio. What? Grabbed that horsepower. Was like, damn, who this? I said, that's Cam stuff. He took it. <laughs> he took like two of them. So don't say nothing. Don't, we don't say nothing. <laughs> so he doubled back. Went, he like, yo, man, ain't nobody. What's up with... I said, dang, you already took two of them, Lisa. Yeah. Yo. <laughs> he missed a strip club. He a strip club but, warrior. He starts being off the bitch like never before, man. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm talking about, I'm talking about, I'm, I'm, oh, this, yeah. I'm definitely like the hair club for men. I'm not just the president. I'm a client. <laughs> Make sure you go to pink-horsepower.net. You have the best time of your life, baby. <laughs> your woman will be happy. She won't leave you. Listen, man. And I don't know how old your audience is, but Roxanne Shantae, she because she was out when I was a little. Yeah, she's little a legend. Yeah. She walked up to me. We did Rock the Bells a couple years ago. She said, Kim. She grabbed that. She said, yo, Kim. First of all, y'all know we had a nice ass crib when the bell <laughs> went like that. <laughs> yeah. So like she'd be like, crazy. bang. Let me see But I, 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 I seen that rock the bell. She said, Kim. That pink horsepower saved my marriage. What? Rock she messed with. Her, I ain't gonna say who she messed. I, oh, I don't. I don't know. I know she, she messed with. Who she messed with, man? Do she mess with big horse? What's the boy? Uh, is her husband? I, I don't know. Uh, I, I think he's. I'm, 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 I'm not with big horse. Was little pony. He was at the studio. He was at the studio. <laughs> 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 big horse was little pony till he got some of that horse. If I'm wrong, I'm sorry. <laughs> fact, she definitely told me, yo, that should save my marriage. So. If you're having trouble at home, <laughs> pink hyphen horsepower.net. Save your marriage. Now, now some people was so mad. You never took none? No, I'm natural. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> listen, listen, listen. I'm now, natural. Now, if some people was mad at y'all because some flyers came out that y'all was going on tour. Mm-hmm. And all of a sudden, it's, it didn't happen. Mm-hmm. So, like, what's going on? Like, you know what I mean? Like, like 
Alex, AG, uh, Sean G, Live Nation, like, what's up with this tour? Like, what's going on? Like, we, like, well, like what happened was, this, this is this is kind of fun. it's kind of a funny story to be honest with you. <laughs> no, the reason why what I'm makes funny, do, man? No, no it, the reason it's funny because this you no, know, this is my <laughs> so I know that it's, it was he ain't do nothing wrong. It was solely and I got thrown these on the bus. Got thrown these on the bus. There's a promoter named Antonio from Virginia who was putting this tour together. I don't know if he was saying he was he was on the hook for a lot of. Uh, the arenas they were doing. So I don't know if he was like in the sales or he wasn't getting the money he's supposed to get. More of the story is he put it together and it didn't uh, pan out the way it's supposed to go. A lot of people be like, because they know Mesa leave. So a lot of niggas hit me like, yo, this is Mace. I knew it wouldn't last, this, that, and the third. I'm like, nah, it wasn't. This wasn't Mace or whatever. So I got to go back because I'm putting this tour together with this. Thing. I don't you know. I'm not putting tours together. I just know. So I got to go back to Mace and tell yo. him this thing. This shit ain't go through. Hey, oh, hey, Sean G. What's up? Sean, this, I, I, got, I got Mace and I got Cam around right here, right now. This is Sean G, president of Live Nation Urban. Mm -hmm. I said, what's up with the tour with them? I would I would put them on tour tomorrow. All right, so listen. Uh, they, oh, they, they, shut they, up. I got it from me. Oh, no. <laughs> get off the I got this. All right, we will get this. Shower. I got that. <laughs> now, 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 what about, what about, what about Roots Picnic next year? I'm already, I was... Searching around to see who book him. I used to book Mace directly with, with himself, but somebody told me calendar at UGA book Cam. I've been searching around because I want to do the, I want to do the uh, the podcast live at Roots Picnic, and I want to potentially put a set together, a music set together with both of them. So now, Sean, you, 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 we, we Philly. Got a socket to my man's pocket like a rocket. There, there you go. So you need to talk up a Hold up, shut up, shut up. Phone, I got that. Dude, I already did it in the back end. Shut up. Right. That's why I'm still your manager. Shut now, the fuck out of here. now, I'm a, listen. You on, I'm gonna put you on text with the with the fellas. Listen, a tour, they you know get on percentage. You know what I mean? So I'm gonna put you on text and y'all go from there. All right. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Yo, do I do, do I need to deal with y'all directly? Because you know, out in the street, everyone says different people represent y'all. Oh no, I'm putting you on the phone. I'm putting you to text with Cam and Mace. Nobody else. I don't know nothing about no representation. Right, right, right. That's all. I and me, make sure I now, represent them. I, I represent, you know, them too. That's another story. <laughs> uh, all right. But I'm going to put you directly on it. All right, Sean? Let's do it. All right, bet. Now, look, Wallo, that was dope. And I thank you. Oh, thank yeah, both thank you guys. You ain't going to stop me. Check no, for all of us. We all no, need no, together. No, what I'm saying is this. <laughs> no, I'm just playing. I make these same nobody. phone calls. You post them. And May says, Cam. <laughs> what the fuck are you doing, How much Cam? money do they get? I'm not going to say on TV, this man don't be moving. I don't no. I don't know in between the time. I just talked to him. No, yeah, I just had a talk. Listen, listen, bro. I'm talk. telling you, I'll be just with six days a week. I don't know what type of money was made in between the time he wasn't speaking. But this don't well, the conversation which you have with him here and he'll tell you we could do it, that's not the conversation. <laughs> the conversation you know, it's, no, it's, it's a separate conversation. <laughs> we had to cover a Rolling Stone the other day. He said, if I can't approve the photos, then the cover can't come out. It's like he it, it move a little different. So okay. it's, it's a whole this different boy, conversation. This boy Mace, man. I was murdered. P. Diddy named me pretty. Look at you was little meth little <laughs> Spencer. I know you. He was in prison when it all the talent shows. He knew yes, how you so Mace I'm saying, from 20-something years ago. I don't want you to think Cole. this can't happen, but I just want you happen. to know. Mace, just tell me a number. No, it, happen, it happens. I'm going to get you a number. I'm Give me a number. I'm going to go get it. I guarantee yeah. you. Mm -hmm. Anything me and Cam doing together should be a real moment. So if it's a real moment... It's a real check. It's not. Oh, yeah, I dig it. It's not a regular check. You know what I'm saying? Because I could get a regular check by myself. Yes, he sir. can get a regular check on by itself. So even when we came together to do what we're doing now, it was the same way. Cam had one number in his mind. I had a, a multiple number in my mind. Right, Cam? This is true. And we was able to. That's get what makes that. y'all. That's what makes y'all you know win. Because that's why y'all win. Numbers. No, that's what the, makes us strong. No, no sir, it's yeah. an actual fact. Because when I'm calling around. If, if we talk strictly like this, yeah. the sports show, when I'm calling around, I'm calling y'all. I'm calling, I call Wilo and got a number. Yeah. What's a re, what's an outrageous number? You told me the number. I'm not going to say it on here or mm -hmm. whatever. So I go back, Mace, I was like, yo, we dealing with Rich Kleiman, you know, Kevin Durant. Did and I tell you a real number, though? You tell it, us it, you it wasn't nowhere close to what we got. But I know, I'm, but I'm I told you a number. number. You what know I'm saying is, if I'm, the more reason I'm bringing this up is because I'm saying is this. 
I'm talking to people in the space that's getting this telling yeah. us, uh -huh. yo, this is what's realistic. This uh -huh. is what's realistic. This is what's realistic. So when I go back and tell Mace, Mace is like, well, we got that already. And uh -huh. I'm like, yeah, that's true. But uh -huh. they're telling us they're not giving to us like that. But to Mace's credit, he's absolutely right. He yeah. stood tall on a number and he's like, <laughs> well, we're not going to take this number because the money that they're offering in this space, we already have. And the reason he's bringing that up to you guys right now is to give you guys basically to tell y'all this may not happen. Don't come back without a moment number. Listen, right. I know yeah, I'm no, talking. I know it's right. gonna happen. I know. It's gonna happen. Yeah, I know. No, no, that's no, what I'm. You on. gotta read his disclaimer. <laughs> listen, listen, listen. He's telling you like listen, this because just like this. Like, just, like this just like this. They are gonna tell you, and like I told you that in the conversation before. Be, be, because y'all done had so much episodes, so much, y'all can't get this. I know y'all could get anything. Mm -hmm. Everything could be got. I know. Mm -hmm. You see what I'm saying? It's just about having the right partner to understand right. y'all impact on culture. So the moment number he talking about, mm -hmm. I understand that moment. Right. And they give out that moment number with the person I was just talking to. Because mm -hmm. yeah. I didn't see, it's some serious yeah. numbers, you know what I mean? Right. For, 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 them, for that moment, and even if it's just that day. Right. Is 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 it's unbelievable money right there for that. Right. So I know what he's talking about. He right. supposed yeah. to get that. He no, put just, the work in to get that shit. Right. I'm just telling you how to read his disclaimer. I know what he's saying. I know what he's saying. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Man, <laughs> we would understand what he's saying. He was murdered. P. Diddy <laughs> made him pretty. <laughs> <laughs> now all about the dollars you need to get with me. <laughs> but now, but now, this whole thing. What's up? Any music coming out? I just seen. We just seen you spitting. We went crazy on the recipe. This is what I'm trying to explain to y'all. We got songs done. I don't oh, know how time we can use much fun of songs. Oh, man. <laughs> well, what is that man, I don't know how much he be wanting. I'm just telling you something. It's a bunch of well, shit. Well, Mace went to church, the Lord blessed him. <laughs> <laughs> bless him. Bless him. It's a different blessing. That's it, Gary. Because you also said, too, Gilly, you said, I don't care what we doing. Six o'clock come, he got to get that sermon. That rolls out. <laughs> right, bye, killer. I'm gone. That's, that's I gotta, I gotta get on the. Yeah. yeah. So I said, okay. I do a summer. I do a summer with. It was called Summer with God. It's a mentorship for just a bunch of bunch of people around the world. That's beautiful. That's what's up, man. Around the world, though. Yeah. Not in the country. Yeah. See, one thing about me, man. I respect all religions, man. I don't care. What you which what, what religion you are, what you believe in, just believe in something, man. So yeah, that's a fact. That's what I'm at. That's what it's about, man. But listen, man, we gotta uh we gotta figure it out, man, because the people wanna see y'all bad. They wanna see y'all bad. I know this I, I know. We gonna get we gotta figure the number the moment number. The, that's what it is, the, the moment, moment number. number. I'm already turning into a moment agent. Go get that money number. <laughs> yeah. Cause I know where it's at. It's all, it's all, that, that's what I be trying to tell people. Like, Gil, 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 somebody call Gil, be like, hold on, let me put you on the phone while I tell people. They be like, what? Show me the money. I'm gonna show you where the money at. It's all over this joint. We keep looking at the regular, the regular, oh, this is the only way. No, it's a thousand brands out here. Mm -hmm. They got money just sitting around that, that, mm -hmm. that somebody gotta be able to articulate culture and your impact on culture to them. And they like, oh, what? That's what that mean? They going to you know bring Trump beep 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 is a rat right. life changing money, so you know it's like I understand what he's saying though because that's a big moment. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's just understanding like a lot of artists do this well and some artists don't. I think Killer was one of the Can't. people that also that's the text, was you able it? to do this very well. It's when you can when you can see the future it's when, it's of the your business. Phone too. You got to make the number the future oh, number. Yes, you can't yes. lock yourself in for one thing oh, and it turns into yeah. multi millions and you only was locked in for a hundred thousand. Yep. You, you played yourself. That, you played yourself. So that's that's really what he It's just like about. publishing. Yeah. When they go to sell by the pu publishing, uh, uh, you know, catalogs yeah. and all that. Knowing what it turn into. It's going to turn into yeah. five years from now. You know, so we're going to figure that out. But listen, man, at the end of the day, man, Call me, man. And I am. I, going, I'm going to call always you. listening. I'm yeah. going to call you, but my whole thing is this: none of you would have went to played in the NBA. That we get, let's get that. We got to end this shit. With that. <laughs> you 
It was journeyman. <laughs> yeah. Y'all was, yeah. was, 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 was bitch to mix me. Y'all would have been a bitch. That's why. That's why I'm not saying journeyman. Listen, I call him. What do you think he would have been playing? He'd have been playing. He was a captain of the wrestling team. Gil would have been a bitch commissioner or something. I see they went to the Fresh Air Fund too with the, with the white people too. Huh? Where they sent them to the Fresh Air Fund. You posted yeah, it on your page. Yeah, and, he he stole, yeah. and he stole their <laughs> shit. Yeah. I'm going to say and, this. And, and, and hold on, hold on. What about when you was locked up and you was the, the uh, what was you, the captain? What was the n***a's names? Who? When you all went, got the cowboy suit on and you in the front seat. No, that was, that was Vision Quest. That was vision. Juvenile shit. The well, Buffalo what was soldier. the name of it? Buffalo but, Soldier. That was Juvenile. <laughs> you know, but listen, I'm going to say this. Was the captain I'm of the this, Buffalo the the Soldiers? Day, I don't know who was the player that Mace called the bum, and I was like, "No, he's good." Mace ain't had no game to be calling him a bum. It was some dude that wound up being a bum. But I'm saying, if he in the NBA, how can these boys call him a bum? It ain't no bums in the NBA. You know, I was when I was arguing with you about, he was like, "No, it's a bunch of bums in the NBA." Lo, <laughs> I'm like, "No, it's not. These guys is professionals." Like I didn't understand that, so you know, because my game is a little throwback, so I wasn't, I didn't never get tapped into from having the game to being ever the sports analyst that you dudes is, but I don't understand how y'all, all three of y'all be calling people bums, and they professional athletes. Who's worst playing in the league right now? Giannis Brothers. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> what we said is, we, we made a shit the other day on the show, they are probably the only two people that you have no footage on to get them to the league. Everybody you got a scout tape on, college film, high school film. You cannot find any film on Giannis's brothers to justify them being in the NBA. That's why Gil and Mickey, you ain't had no film. <laughs> you ain't had no film. That's why you went to the neighborhood of the college. You ain't had no film. I know, I was trying to wonder, he didn't have no film. You ain't had no film. That's why you still play the play back. And then Gil, I got film with you. You're the 40-year-old, you're like a 40, listen, you're the 40-year-old gym rat. You just be in the gym shooting all day. He shooting all day. Of course you won't make the jokes. First of all, first you in the gym all nigga, night. You know I for no go to the gym. You got I a gym membership. I weed all day. You gym membership. You I smoke ain't weed cool, all day and I play basketball like no three, four K. times a month. He didn't have and no. Over, I know what you mean. talking about me. No proof that you was legend. who you, you say you were. You could try to shit my game, but everybody in the hood just laughing. Just like, yeah, why we just being funny? We know what Gil was. Yeah. You went to a strip mall college. About? I went to a legendary college. college. That's your whole, this is the size about? of a Chinese store. That's your whole, like, it's five people in the room. Fuck out of He's a mom. He's a mom. Like, these boys is crazy, man. He's because he was a good fucking wrestling champion, Jim. Yeah. 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 Call him Dick Flair. Yo, I'll be in the gym, too. I'll be in the gym, too. I'll be in the gym, too. Fuck out of here. You know that shit. Fucking wrong with him. And he was the captain of the sewing team. Yo, I'll be in the gym. Nick Sweaters, man. So is Nick Sweaters was <laughs> named Big Stormy and shit listen, like this. Listen, yeah. listen, and then I'll be in the and gym. The I'll chef. be in the gym with this nigga. This nigga be in the gym shooting these shots, getting this shit off with these bums. These these dudes never play no real first organized of all, ball. First he of getting all, shit off. He, he in this. You see me do that what? against Lethal Shooter. I'm like. You see me do that against Jalen Ramsey. Yeah, he's well, a football you player. You see me do that against Famous Loose. Who's Famous Loose? Uh, a and on Instagram, hey, none of them play the league. basketball. None of them played in the college. Please. They didn't even play college. You already seen Rasheed Wallace come up and say, no, Gil Cook. You, you, tell me, you, the, you listen, already see Alvin Williams I'm a, I'm the, I'm that played in the league. I I'm, cook I'm, shit. I, Ask Cat Mobley. I'm I the, cook listen, shit. Listen, you, you super good because I've seen big three MVP back to back. But to Wallow's point, you didn't. Everybody you named has never Thank been in the you. league just now. Bro. Nobody never had no. <laughs> nobody never, nobody never played in the league. Just, you that's your favorite. favorite. You that's your favorite. I will you cook the shit out of Joe Johnson. Yo, yo, that's right your favorite. Now. I will cook the shit out of Joe Johnson. All of them that Joe played in the league. Joe Johnson. What? Joe, Joe Johnson. Johnson. Joe Jackson. <laughs> no, that don't fucking Joe Jackson. Joe Jackson. Joe Jackson. Joe Jackson. Beat the kids. I saw Joe. <laughs> I you, Joe. you killed Joe Johnson right now? I will cook this well, shit I, out of Ice Joe. He Joe. lying. Okay, this, I, this I is a good one. Joe. This is a good one. He lying. Because Gil Nice, yo, for. I, what do you mean I'm lying, dog? Let me ask Everybody you I get on the front row, I don't even play over 35. That's disrespecting my game. That's like playing a park card. Because you talking about I don't even play old. Oh, okay, I only play young. You better. Let me ask you this question. And I'm just, just my opinion. Because. <laughs> I stopped hating on you a while ago, so I root for you. I'm okay, like, fuck it, this nigga that, Gil man. is out here killing. Yeah. Thank you, man. And I can't kill like this, and I was jealous, and he I was niggas. mad. He, he but playing. are you better than Jamal Crawford right now? Yes. Now you're out your damn Thank you. Thank you. Now you know what I'm talking about. Hold up, hold up. This 
Okay, okay, let me just say this. Jamal Crawford is going to get his baskets. That's what he do. He cook everybody. Okay. But guess who else going in the oven? Jamal <laughs> Crawford. He got a fucking All right, let's me. think of now, somebody I'm that's like, your height. I'm like Bubba. I'm like Bubba Chuck. I know I'm a motherfucking liability on my defense, but guess what? I'm such a liability on offense that it don't even matter. Ask Rowdy Rebel. Got him the out of here, ask Rob Fortnite. Got him the fuck out of here, ask Chris Brown. Got him the fuck out of here. He just talking about a bunch ask of dudes Russ. that smoke bad weed. Got him the fuck out of here. These young boys Yo, smoke I bad weed. Hold on, hold on, hold on. You, you see me Jamal playing? Crawford, wait, hold on. <laughs> you see me playing <laughs> Lethal Shooter? That is in the gym every day, all day, right? We playing one on one. Did he have to take me to the basket? And push me out of bounds. I said, "Damn, bro, you playing like this?" He said, "I gotta win." Six four, six five, two fifty. You seen the fuck me whoa, cooking whoa. the shit Can out of this? Back to back. Can't, can't, That's the thing. Can't. That's the thing about me. That's I don't so quit cool. to give a highlight tapes. All my shit so listen, be in a row. You gonna get baskets in a row? Six seven straight baskets in a row. Everything I love. Most of the time. Most of the time he in the gym, Cam, Cam. Most of the time he in the gym. 99% of the time he in the gym. He's playing against that do two things. Either smoke bad weed or play with their nose. So the don't care. The don't care. The don't care. you don't care. So you won't put the young chopper smoke bad weed. No, I ain't talking about the young folks. That's who I'm playing. You don't talk about. When you be in the gym, all the devil play old niggas. Play old niggas. This is what Play with it's nose. two things. It's two things. Now, it's two things. Real quick, it's bubs. It's two things. Like I gotta say, I'm not hating on Gilly. That nigga got MVP in the big three twice yeah, back to back. I don't even get that. No, but hold I on. Let, defensive me, player let me say it. what I gotta say real oh, quick. Right. But everybody, Gil named, never been the NBA, and when it's time to go to the NBA. He always go to Catino Mobile. This is the fourth time we've been together, hey, and it's go to. It's I'm just my man. Ain't my <laughs> so they can talk to me. All yeah. you gotta do is call Jamal Crawford up. I'll be in Atlanta. This is a bum. Deep frying. This is a bum. Hey, hey, we had this conversation. Gil, stop it, bro. Okay. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Who that? Stop it, Father. You call stack, stack up. Stack yeah. it. Stop it, bro. First of all, do you know how much mileage Jamal Crawford got on them fing knees? I just watched. Hey, hey, oh. Hey, what about Isaiah hey, Thomas? Hold up. Hold up. Yo, ask so Stack. I support y'all, and I'm watching now. Shout out to all y'all. Love all y'all. Appreciate it. Hey, yo, Stack. Let me ask Stack. Yo, Stack. Can I? Yo, Stack. Stack. I, stack. So you don't think I'll give Jamal Crawford some stack, baskets? Stack. He said he better than Jamal Crawford right now. Cam. Cam. That's what made me call in. <laughs> <laughs> Cam. Cam. That's what made me call in. Yo, you wild. You out of your mind, man. I just had to call in to say stop it, bro. He said he ain't never. <laughs> you know. I, I holler at y'all. He ain't yeah, yeah, I you go know. and say, stop it. Y'all hating on my game. No doubt. I told you I ain't well, Let me no. just ask you a question. Do y'all know what the youngins call me? What is Chauncey it Chauncey Gillups. What's the new one? What's happening? What's the new one? Damian Gillups. Gill yeah, we know their nickname. Sam Gilsell. You, you gave yourself all these names. No, the youngins <laughs> call me this. Shay Gilgis Alexander. <laughs> <laughs> Grant Gill. <laughs> <laughs> what I'm really on, you know what they call me? Mike Gill Jordan. No, I'm just saying. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just saying. I told you I'm not hating on you, but you gotta start with Jamal yeah, Crawford. Yeah, You're going too far. I bet you, I bet you, I bet you Jamal Crawford. Listen, right now here on me and I was worth a game. Mm -hmm. I bet you Jamal Crawford will not accept this challenge one-on-one. -on -one. I call him and see. <laughs> By, ton by tonight, I have an answer for All you. Right. One on one, I'm gonna come to wherever he at. I'm gonna bring my no, cameras. No, 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 no. We gonna get the money out of it. We gonna, we gonna wait. Same way, he, well, I send up. Okay. We gonna set, we it, gonna up, set right. it up. We pay per view in that. Jamal Crawford against Damian Gillard. You, you wow. out your mind, girl? I was with you for a minute. <laughs> man. Uh, what you all about? Six four. Yes, that's, that's, that's what, easy. That's work. why I said Isaiah that's Thomas. Easy he is size. Oh no, nah, and deep fry Isaiah Thomas. He too. Little man, you got to be at least 6'3, 6'4 to even Mad disrespectful Dull. to Seattle players, man. Dull. The Seattle Dull. is Dull. nice, bro. Super Isaiah Thomas is a legend. I will deep fry his young ass, <laughs> deep oven fry, bro. My shit is I shoot better than 70% of the in the NBA. You right hear this dumb, now. You hear this dumb shit? 
Right now. Right now. You're not shooting where they shooting at. Yeah. <laughs> you ain't okay. got the defense okay. on you. Okay. okay, okay, okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You see me playing the big three. Mm-hmm. I hit four threes and a four pointer. Did any of them that played in the big three hit, hit any of that? Shit? I'm confused. Yo, my is damn near. My is damn near. If you're open, you gotta, yeah, yeah, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta stop. Good. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta stop real. a little bit. Let's shooting is shooting. Yeah, yeah. 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 You gotta shooting stop. Shooting is shooting, right? Yeah. You gotta stop. Larry, Larry. If, I hit, if I hit four threes, <laughs> if I hit four threes <laughs> and a four point. <laughs> Said Rowdy Rebel and and another yeah, like, like Rowdy Rebel, that? my man, but you but he garbage, yeah. right? Nah, nah, I don't know. I just see the highlights. <laughs> now everybody highlights is gonna look good on Instagram. I don't know. No, I don't I, know that's the difference. Not. I don't do highlights. I show you baskets you in a row. With Jamal Crawford, everybody else, I got your back, and I don't know about Joe right. Johnson either. Well, so so name Jamal one else, Mark. In the I'm the only two. Me I'm against give Isaiah Thomas. That's perfect because we both left handed. Yeah, that's and why both, I said that. Yeah, set it up, Zeke. What you want to do? Just crazy. What you want to do? These I are guys that still could be in the league. Yeah, that's why I said that. <laughs> yeah, it ain't like they washed. That's the beauty of it. That's what's going to make it good, Paul. That's the beauty of it because... Let oh, me ask no, you a you're question. not beating this dude. <laughs> let me ask you a question. Do you not think... I'm a, do you not think I'm, a, I'm not going to get off? If you don't... See, the part... The thing about it, it depends on how the rules go. If the loser take the ball out, then maybe. But if the winner take... The person who scored take to get the ball back... You may not get the ball. I'm done. <laughs> yeah, to wrap it up. Yeah, wrap it up. Yeah. <laughs> I slapped the floor like Duke on him. <laughs> now he Bobby Hurley. You cannot steal the ball from Jamal Crawford, bro. He can't steal the ball from me. L- Jamal get, Crawford, you, the you, beast. You, listen, My nothing, shit on a yo-yo. The number thing is like this, Gil, and I'm, I'm telling you because I'm, I'm not hating on you. <laughs> It's a shot clock. You like to catch your breath. You hold the ball. No. I see no. what you get. Hold, hold. Let me ask I'm you a question. This. I'm telling you. How I'm many games it. did I play the other day playing against the pros? You run like seven. And, and, wait, 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 wait. wait. All, all these players played NBA G League and overseas. Yo, yo, they, hold on. They yo. all played for money, right? Yeah. What was the record when we left out of that month? You filmed it. Uh, four, three, Who you work for, oh, bro? Okay. <laughs> Who you work for? Oh, no, it's on oh, film. Okay. No, I asked, it's on I film. asked him, what do you have to say? Hold on. <laughs> you want to pull up the film? <laughs> yeah, with, yeah, with he's shaping the, the yeah, narrative. Yeah, you work for him. Yeah, he's shaping the narrative. You want to pull yeah, up you know, the yeah. film for them <laughs> with a <laughs> who's 6'8 is sitting on the floor saying, I can't believe I lost Where this is nigga this that? Who does he play for? He played. G League. 10 years overseas. G League. It's a Cisco this Bobcat. He played <laughs> he played professional ball. <laughs> it ain't my fault, you know, we play it. I'm, I'm just saying two, all I, I said was professional athletes for a living. I got three Isaiah Thomas, Jamal, Crawford, hey, and ISO Joe. Everything else you got, I got ISO Joe. You got credit. Joe, Joe Johnson. Johnson. Come on, man. You gotta give Joe me Joe Johnson credit, the black so. six nine, ain't he? Yeah. This is he what he said going, he cooked him. That's what he just just said. He said he would cook Joe Johnson. I just seen him at the big three. I'm not saying that shit. Remember I'm not saying I'm going to win, but they're going to be like, man, Gilly was cooking that shit, man. He going to block all your shots. Now you crazy as them old ass knees, man. <laughs> Play 11,000 games, man. The <laughs> attendants all loose and shit, man. He got man, out, man, I run like a young man. You just seen me beat my 26-year-old f-ing brother in a race. Everybody you name don't count, bro. <laughs> Naming random people. <laughs> he got me on his I, I cook wild over before. <laughs> I'm beating 26-year-old f-ing in races, man. Think about that. Crazy. Yo, think about bro, your, think it, about your son who walk around here with his shirt all off like this. <laughs> you going outside and beating him in a race right now? I'm, it depends. I can I can no, beat you niggas in a race. No, you can't, Cam. You dead I can't horse play power, basketball. No, up, I can't play basketball for forty That's minutes. <laughs> but a race, I got a here could beat you in a race. The fuck out of My here. man Tito, you going to be right there? Right, right there. Yeah. Yeah. Tito, right, right, right now. Out of Tito. I, 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 I when it's over, he beat you in the race. The <laughs> shit out of Tito. It's a bet. Tito, I don't even know why you hey, raised your hand. The you volunteered age. for y'all a the cooking. Same, y'all Tito's the same 20. Age. Tito, no. are you 23, man? Nah, Tito, 46. Tito, how old is you? 46. No, how old is you for real, Tito? 1977, March 21st. Y'all the same age. Oh, you talking about that Yes, I thought you was talking about younger than the bet. No, I cooked it. It's a race. It's a bet. I will cook this shit. Out of here. Yes. I, I got he raised his hand. I'm talking no, to you. No, that old ass. 
Hundred dollars, y'all the same age. Gil gonna smoke it. Oh, 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 them back. black forces. What side the back. F is you talking about? That's a side back. Yeah. That is all. No, 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 Cause you better cook it. Your muscles ain't he? We you got one gotta run like this. He, right. he you can't even run like this. You gonna be sad after this, kid. Then after that, I want to do this. He's stretching his shit. Ain't no shit on the show. Yes, yes. You want to use your own bag? Yes. What will we? All right, back. That's as soon as it's over, we going right outside. Outside, it's free right there. Ain't like nobody coming in the weed. Don't give a about none of it. You think you're talking about you gonna give me two to one? Letting, you think I'm letting the old head and smoke reefer beat me, man? Right, you still smoke reefer, man? <laughs> he he stretched. Look, he stretched. He over there sweating. Look, right. he stretched. Look, look at the sweat coming down. All he did was stretch. Oh, hey, look at him. They got to talk about it no more. No, no, all he did was stretch. Come on, let's get to the work. Come on, let's get to it. Let's get to it. It's just like that. Right. Oh, oh. Hey, let me get the winner. I'll take the winner. Winner. <laughs> I'll take the winner because I know I'm from where to win, Mace. Stop sign. The Stop sign. Can I get the winner? Gilly look like he's walking slow down there. They gonna smoke Gilly. That's uphill too. He wanted that to Gilly. He wanna go downhill. Stay up there so we can make sure niggas ain't in front of. Niggas. You want it now too? No, I'm gonna be down here to say who won. Come on, Mace. I'm gonna lift my hand if the left side win or the right <laughs> side win. <laughs> Yo, I'm crazy. I'm clocking your time. Come on. My hamstring acting up today. Yo, make sure you get that on camera, because Mace might cheat. Ready, set, go. Oh, you got him. Yo, yo. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh yeah, he beat him. Oh, no. Who won? Get those hey, cats. Go to the tape. Ah, I knew Tito won. Tito won. You grabbing your leg. <laughs> my knot up, man. Tito was at 843. You were at um, 852. Because you had hey. one. Everybody was watching. You know everybody. You had him at first. You had him. What do we do when we build this money? We rip it up. What? Do we do this money? Uh, what you better not do that, nigga. <laughs> 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 you don't take <laughs> <the> money, man. <laughs> 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 Mercy, top dog, the top one. Mercy, what's good with you, boy?